Mosquitoes bite us, using a specialized mouth part called a proboscis. The proboscis is a long, slender structure that is used to pierce the skin, and access blood vessels beneath the surface. Here's how the process works. Mosquitoes are attracted to their hosts by various cues, including body heat, body odor, carbon dioxide, and movement. Once they detect a potential host, they fly towards it. When a mosquito lands on your skin, it uses its six legs to stabilize itself. The mosquito extends its proboscis, which consists of two tubes. One tube, called the labrum, acts as a guide while the other tube, called the hypopharynx, is used to deliver saliva. The mosquito uses its labrum to probe the skin, and find a suitable blood vessel. Once it locates a blood vessel, it pierces the skin using specialized serrated mouth parts. These mouth parts are designed to create a small opening in the skin, without causing too much pain or alerting the host. As the mosquito pierces the skin, it releases saliva into the wound. Mosquito saliva contains enzymes that help prevent the blood from clotting while the mosquito feeds. It's this saliva that often causes the itching and irritation associated with mosquito bites. The mosquito uses its hypopharynx to suck up blood from the blood vessel. It typically feeds for a few minutes, during which it ingests a blood meal that provides essential nutrients for egg development in female mosquitoes. Once the mosquito has had its fill of blood, it withdraws its proboscis and flies away. It's worth noting, that only female mosquitoes bite humans and animals, as they require the nutrients from the blood for their egg-laying process. Male mosquitoes primarily feed on nectar from flowers.